Head wigglies? Head wigglies. When you drink something cold too fast and your head gets all wiggly. You Brits are baby talk for everything. Guys. Kelly, Laurie, Willie, nothing for Guys, me. Well, you have very silly things in your vocabulary as well. Like what? American exceptionalism. <laughs> nice. Former colony bird. Bachelor Brit with eyes of frosted steel. Steel's a bit cold. I mean, maybe corn flour? <laughs> Beans on toast. Sounds disgusting, but on the spectrum of English cooking, I would put it up there with cabbage bread and lung pudding. Scrambled eggs, a dish so pedestrian its name is the recipe. It's called a reservation, right? Not a suggestion of eagerness to dine at a specific hour. The DVD selection is pathetic here, but what do you expect from a town whose tax money all goes to opioid treatment and bark beetle eradication? It's not a key. It's a symbol of what? Of the unceasing, inexorable march of everything towards predictability, blandness, and mediocrity. It's the Rachel Raying of the world. Like they say, tits or GTFO. What does that stand for? I'm not sure exactly. I think maybe tits or get my fanny out. You gonna help me shop? Hell no. I'm going for literary inspiration. I'm not finding it here, so maybe I'll find it amongst the diabetic masses of the American shopper. I'm like Thoreau, only the mall shall be my Walden. Malden. <laughs> <laughs> I would have found that eventually. Ah, the cold, egalitarian hand of lady democracy has triumphed once again. God save the queen. God save the queen.